to say, everybody, yeah, this is what I'm looking like today. I'm going to stand in front of the door so all you can see is my face. How's that? <laughs> Much better. Um, good morning. It's morning here in Casablanca. It's our last few days at this apartment that we are house sitting in Casablanca. Thanks, Kathy and Bob. It's been really fun looking after the little kitties. We got Spooky hiding over there, and Honey Badger is hiding over here, but you'll see them both soon. I'm sure as soon as I get on my mat, they'll probably get on my mat too. So this is a furious flow we're gonna do today. I'm feeling the need for speed, maybe? Not really. Uh, the need to move, because this apartment has been our home, and in some ways a bit of our prison for the last few weeks. Uh, it's not like really as awful as that sounds. It's a really nice apartment, but outside there's a lot of construction, there's a lot of traffic, there's a lot of dirty exhaust. There are narrow streets, so you're really in the exhaust if you go out for a walk. We have a beautiful park just a couple of blocks away, the Park of the Arab League, but it's in the last few months of a massive redevelopment, so it's mostly fenced off and not very nice to walk in the parks you can walk in. So we've been really stuck in the apartment, which is good because we have lots of work to do and lots of work to catch up on. But it does mean that we haven't been getting outside and going for long walks like we have been quite a bit in our like regular life. Um, but we've got about an hour of flow that I'm planning today. So let's get started. Thanks for joining me, everybody. Namaste. Welcome to 2018. Let's see what we can do with this year. And if I'm at, unroll yours, have a seat, we'll get started. I told you the cats would show up as soon as I sat down. This is Honey Badger. If you don't give a fuck, if you don't know what that's a reference to, you can Google, ba Google Honey Badger on YouTube and uh, watch the fun video. Take a comfortable seat. And sit up tall. In the instructions for class today, it says maximum movement with minimal instruction. So sometimes I do my vinyasa classes starting with longer holds for the first rounds. Today we're going to skip that and we're going to be a little bit faster at the beginning of our Surya A's and Surya B's. But for now, settle. Relax your eyes or close them if you like, and sit up tall. Breathe through your nose. Relax your mind. Relax your thoughts. towards your spine slightly. Sit up tall. We call that Uddiyana Vajra. Engage slightly in the sides of your throat, like you're trying to do Darth Vader breath or sound like the ocean. Begin 
ujjayi pranayam. Work to make your inhale and exhale the same length as each other. sound to your breath, the back of your throat, like you're blowing over the top of a bottle, because it's your breath moving over the top of your throat. And we'll use our breath today to keep us focused, to keep us present. Start together with our breath. Wherever you are in your breath, exhale fully. And at the bottom of your exhale, hold your breath out. At the very bottom of your exhale, your pelvic floor will come. So you get some free mula bandha as you hold your breath out. I'm going to count our breath to a count of four so that we can breathe together. Inhale. One. Two. Three. Exhale, four, three, two, one. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Pause. Exhale, four, three, two, one. Inhale, one, two, three, four. Pause. Exhale, four. three rounds on your own. Sing one ohm together to begin. Inhale. Oh. Now your chin. to the ground behind you, exhale, uncross your legs, place your feet on the ground, inhale, walk your hands forward, exhale, stand up, inhale, tadasana, honey badger's looking at me like, what is going on, it's called yoga, honey badger, inhale, stretch your arms up, urdhva hastasana, Exhale, Uttanasana, fold forward, touch the ground. Ardha Uttanasana, inhale, straighten your arms, lift your chest. Fold forward, Uttanasana. Do a few rounds like that. Inhale, straighten your arms, lift your chest, stretch your spine. Exhale, fold forward, Uttanasana. One more here, inhale, Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Place your hands on your hips, lift your elbows, inhale, stand up, exhale, Tadasana, inhale, Urdhva Hastasana, exhale, Uttanasana, 
Spin your toes. Then moving them, pull them towards each other so your belly tones a little more as you inhale. Chaturanga Dandasana with your exhale. Bend your elbows, push down through your hands. Stay here, inhale. Place your feet flat as you exhale. Curl up, upward facing dog. Inhale. Stay here, push through your hands. Lift your upper chest, inhale. Tuck your toes, exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale here. Exhale. Push down through your hands. Push forward. Tip your hips up. Inhale. Stretch through your legs. Exhale. Last breath here. Inhale. And exhale. Bend your knees. Exhale, Tadasana. Oh, Honey Badger says lie on your back. Oh, look, he's got a camera. You can barely see him. Oh. Inhale, Urvastasana. Exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, Arda Uttanasana. Exhale, Plank Pose, Palakasana. Inhale here. Exhale, Chakrangana Nasana. Urdhva Mukha Shonasana, inhale. Urdhva Mukha Shonasana, exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Move your chest back, lift your tailbone up. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale, bend your knees. Sorry, Namaskar A's on your own.
any sounds like you might have just heard in the house where you have a broken refrigerator and we assume that that sound has something to do with the broken refrigerator. shins parallel to the ground. Exhale. Stretch your arms out. Inhale. Spread your toes. Exhale. Stretch your spine long. Work to be sitting on your sit bones, not rolling back to the top of your pelvis. Inhale. Stay here or exhale and straighten your legs. Inhale. Lower halfway. Exhale. Use your abdomen to bring your legs up again. Inhale. Stretch out through your back to help lower. Exhale, halfway. Let your belly in, flex. Inhale. Exhale, lower halfway. Cross your ankles. Inhale, come up. Bring your feet to the ground and exhale. Jump back to down dog. Inhale. Tadasana, feet together. Inhale, look up, stretch your arms up, bring your hands together. Urdhva Namaskarasana, stay here as you exhale. Inhale. Utkatasana, exhale. Fierce pose, bend your knees. Keep your arms lifted, keep your torso lifted. Inhale, move your hips back even more and sit deeper, exhale. Inhale. Hold forward, Uttanasana, exhale. Arda Uttanasana, inhale. Chattarangananasana, exhale. Urdhva Mukha Svanasana, inhale. Adho Mukha Svanasana, exhale. Spin your left heel down like Warrior One. Step your right foot forward, start your right knee forward. Rise up, Warrior One. And exhale, because you probably had to inhale in there somewhere. Bring your hands together, look up. Push your pelvis down, switch your right knee forward, exhale. Pull your left hip forward, square your hips more, inhale. Bring your hands down, step back and lower, chaturanga, exhale. Upward facing dog, inhale. Downward facing dog, exhale. Spin your right heel down, step your left foot forward, stretch your left knee forward, inhale, rise up. Hands together, exhale. Pull your right hip forward, pull your left hip back, inhale. Push your hips down, stretch your left knee forward more, exhale. Inhale. Exhale, bring your hands down, step back and lower, chaturanga. Inhale, urdhva mukha. Exhale, of the mukha. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Bend your knees. Look forward. Float or walk. Inhale. Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale. Uttanasana. Bend your knees. Lower your hips. Inhale. Utkatasana. Exhale. Tadasana. Sorry, Namaskar B again. Inhale. Utkatasana. Exhale. Uttanasana. Ardha Uttanasana, inhale. Make your way, Chaturanganasana. Exhale. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha Svanasana. Exhale, Adha Mukha Svanasana. Left heel down, right leg forward. Inhale, Virabhadrasana, one. Stay here, exhale. Inhale, stretch up. Exhale, Chaturanganasana. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha. Exhale. 
exhale, Adho Mukha, spin your right heel down, step your left leg forward, inhale, Vira one. Stay here and exhale. Stretch up, inhale. Exhale, Chaturanga Nasana. Inhale, Urdhva Mukha Shvanasana. Exhale, Adho Mukha Shvanasana. Three breaths here. Inhale. Stretch through your spine. Exhale. Stretch through your legs. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Bend your knees. Look forward. Float or walk. Inhale. Ardha Uttanasana. Exhale. Uttanasana. Utkatasana. Inhale. Utkatasana. Uttanasana. Ardha Uttanasana. Chaturanganasana. Urdhva Mukkashvanasana. Adha Mukkashvanasana. Right leg forward. Viravadrasana 1. And move. Chaturanganasana. Urdhva Mukkashvanasana. Adha Mukkashvanasana. Left leg forward. Viravadrasana 1. Chaturanga Nandasana. Urdhva Mukha Shonasana. Abdha Mukha Shonasana. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Bend your knees. Look forward. Walk or float. Ardha Uttanasana, Uttanasana, Utkatasana, Tadasana. Do two Surinam Scarves on your own. Go. Bring your feet together, stretch your arms down at your sides. Utkatasana, bend your knees, lift your arms, inhale. Sit deeper, exhale. Lift your arms up, inhale. Sit all the way down. Exhale. Lift your legs. Stretch your arms out. Inhale. And exhale. Work to be on your sit bones rather than on your sacrum. Stretch your spine. Inhale. Stay here.
here or straighten your legs. Exhale. Inhale, draw your belly and stretch your spine. Use your back to lengthen your spine. And exhale, hold it here. Lower halfway, inhale. Use your core, exhale, lift up. Use your back, inhale, stretch out. Exhale, come up. Inhale, stretch out. Exhale, come up. Inhale, stretch out, cross your ankles. Exhale, come up. Place your hands down, jump back, down dog. Inhale. Exhale. Spin your left heel down, step your right foot forward. Inhale, Virabhadrasana 1. Not my favorite thing to do in the world, but that's, you know, what we have to deal with in life sometimes. Virabhadrasana 3. We're going to do the Iyengar transition. Shift forward. Stretch your arms forward. Stretch your right knee forward. Put a lot of weight in your right foot. Lift your left heel. Use your toes on your left foot to push yourself forward. Shift forward. See, this is why I don't like it, because it's hard for me. Isn't that funny how we're just like, oh, if it's hard, I don't like it. Square your hips so your left hip pulls down. Put your left knee down, right knee straight ahead. I'm going to transition into something weird. Ardha Chandrasana. Bring your right hand down, left arm up. Lift your left hip. Maybe look up. Don't just lift your left leg like it's flying up to the ceiling. Make your legs active towards each other. So hug them in without moving them. Make your legs more active, like triangle legs. Bend into your right knee, Parjva Konasana. Bend your right knee more, float your left leg back, slide your right hand back, put your left arm over your ear, and turn up. Pull your legs towards each other so your pelvis gets a little more support. Then inhale, straighten your right leg, Trikonasana. To the left, Vashistasana. Bring your left hand down, roll over on your left foot, step your right foot back so it's on top of your left, or you can modify by stepping your right foot in front of your hip. You can look at the camera to see my modification. I'll turn sideways a little bit more. Whichever variation you're doing, look up and reach up. Inhale, lift your hips. Sliding away on this floor, going back to my mat. Look down, bring your right arm down, reach it underneath you, reach for the wall behind you if there is one. Inhale, come up, lift your hips a little, exhale, curl. I call these Bashi Stasana curls, I promise you core. Inhale, come up, this is nice on your obliques, nice, what a stupid word. Exhale, curl, inhale, come up. Lift your hips a little, exhale, curl. Inhale, come up. Exhale, downward facing duck. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, spin your right heel down, step your left foot forward, rise up, Virabhadrasana one. All that work, you know, find your pose today. And then dream big. Look forward, lean forward, stretch forward. Put your weight into your left foot, lift your right heel, and then shift forward into Virabhadrasana 3. Turn your right hip down, right knee down. Stretch your spine. Bring your left knee forward, bring your right knee down, bring your left hand down, open your right side up, or just your left side. Squeeze your legs towards each other so you get more lift in your right hip, in the right
right side of your body. Bend into your left knee. Arjuna Konasana, bring your right foot down. Slide your right arm over your ear, slide your left hand back so your wrist under your shoulder, then turn your chest up here. Just like we did in Ardha Chandrasana. Squeeze your legs towards each other so you get more lift in the right side of your hip, right side of your ribs, turn up to the sky. Trikonasana, straighten your left leg, switch your right arm up, look up, squeeze your legs towards each other. Right this time, Vashi Stasana, bring your right hand down, lift your right heel, roll over to the right side of your foot, stack your feet, stretch your left arm up, or step your left foot in front of your hips. Look down, inhale, lift your hips, and exhale, bring your left arm down, reach for the wall behind you, curl underneath and back. Inhale and come up. Lift your hips and exhale, curl. We call these Vashi Stasana curls. Inhale, come up. Exhale, curl. Inhale, come up. Exhale, curl. Inhale, come up. I think we do one more. Exhale, curl. Inhale, come up. Vashi Stasana, sorry, down dog. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Come down to your knees. Exhale. Place your feet flat. Bring your feet together. Bring your knees together. Sit back on your heels. Padrasana. Sit up tall. Adjust your shirt, hair as necessary. Spread your toes, push down through your toes, tighten up your hips a little, and sit up tall. Stretch the fronts of your ankles. Get heavy in your heels. If you can do Virasana without a prop under your pelvis, you can do that. If you need a prop, want a prop, you can go get one and come back. Virasana, separate your feet so that you can sit between your heels on the ground or on your prop. Pull the flesh of your butt out and back. Lean forward a little to help with that. It'll help get your pelvis into neutral so that then you can sit up tall. Think about your feet. And work out your feet going straight back. Spread all of your toes and push your toenails down. Push the tops of your feet down. Think about your outer heels. Hug your outer heels in like you're squeezing an old tube of toothpaste. The old tube of toothpaste is your torso. So hug your ankles in and squeeze it in and up. Lift through your spine. Lift through your neck on all sides. Push down through your feet, stretch through the fronts of your legs, stretch your knees forward. That's more like an energetic, mental action than a big physical action. Walk your hands back. We're not going to lie down. We're going to have you walk your hands back, place your hands flat, push your toes down, lift your pelvis up. So your tailbone is the very end of your spine. Stretch your tailbone towards your knees and lift your pelvis higher. Spread your toes, keep your feet active, lower your pelvis down 
exhale, lower down. Sit up, walk your hands forward, inhale, lift your hips up, tuck your toes, straighten your legs, Kumbhakasana or Palakasana plank pose. Push through your hands, move your hands asymmetrically towards each other. So that means don't actually move them, but hug them in so your ankles, sorry, those are your wrists, the things at the end of your arms. Your wrists are a little more active. Push down through all of your toes evenly and stretch your heels over the balls of your feet. Draw your belly in, stretch your spine. Push up and back, Adho Mukha Svanasana. Slightly step your left foot forward, bring your heel down like warrior one. Step your right foot forward, warrior one. Inhale. And exhale. Lean forward, lift your left heel, inhale. Shift into warrior three, exhale. Inhale, bring your right hand down, lift your left arm, left whole side of your body up, Ardha Chandrasana, and exhale. Inhale, bend into your right knee, float back, Parshvakanasana, exhale. Turn up, inhale, and exhale. Trikonasana, inhale, stretch through your spine. Exhale. Inhale. Vashisthasana to the left. Bring your left hand down. Transition over to the left. Inhale. Lift your hips. Vashisthasana curl. Exhale. Three of these. Inhale up. Exhale curl. Not used to 
used to wearing high heels, this can be incredibly painful. Lean forward, bring your knees back down. Hug your hands forward so they're outside your knee joint. Lean forward, lift your butt up. Lean forward more, bend your knees more, lift your feet up. Hold it, draw your belly in, tone your pelvic floor. Then bring your feet down, bring your butt down, sit up. Depending on the length of your torso versus the length of your arms, touching the ground here can be challenging. You can bring books in to raise the ground up. Books work like yoga blocks, they're just things you already have. Unless you have yoga blocks, you can use those. Fists can help here too, but you don't have as much stability as an open palm. Place your hands between your knees and your greater trochanter, outside your thigh, so about midway. Push your toes down, lean forward, lift your butt up. Bend your knees more, pick your feet up. They won't come up very much, draw your belly in, tone your pelvic floor. Bring your feet down, lean back, lift your knees up. Keep your knees lifted, lift your butt up and lean forward. Lift your butt higher so that your knee joint opens some, because then bend your knee joint, bring your feet off the ground, low lasana. Hold it, tone your pelvic floor, tone your belly, mula bandha, uddiyana bandha, bend your elbows, come down, sit on your heels, sit up. Be grateful there's only one more of those. Whew, we're getting some likes and loves for that, Jane. Nice, I'm a little far away from the camera to see you all, but those who come flying across the screen, so. Thanks. <laughs> Low asana. So we translate this as dangling earring pose. So you're really supposed to swing back and forth three times, like dangling earrings. Try it again. Try it again. Place your hands midway between your knees and your hip. Place your hands on the ground or your blocks. Lean forward. Lift your butt up. Pick your feet up. Lean forward a lot. So you're not going into full pose from here. Feet down and sit down. So I find it's much easier to do this and lean back, lift your knees up. Then lift your butt up, like really open up your knee joint and lean forward, pick your feet up. Swing three times, two, three, and come down. We could then jump our legs out in front of us and do some seated forward folds, but instead I'm gonna have you swing your legs out in front of you so we can do some seated folds. Stretch your left leg out, bend your right leg into Janu Shoshasa. Place your right hand sort of on the joint of your left, your right calf, right thigh. So where they come together, touch there. Touch your left fingertips to the ground. Move your right hip back and twist to the left. Move your right shoulder away from your ear. Sit up taller. Come back to center. Stretch your arms up. Stretch your spine. Pull over your left leg. Janu Shoshasa. Inhale, lift your chest. Stretch your spine. Exhale, fold over your leg. Move your left ribs off to the left. Stretch your spine. Inhale. Fold over your leg. Exhale. Inhale. Instead of touching your left knee here, move closer towards your calf muscle and thigh. It's just a little bit safer place to put pressure. Take your right fingertips back behind you, sit up tall, and twist to the right. So push with your left hand, push down and back with your right hand, and twist to the right. Move your left shoulder away from your ear, sit up tall. Inhale, stretch your arms up. Inhale. 
Inhale, stretch long through your spine. And exhale, fold over your right leg. Down into your chest. Inhale. Lift your head and chest, stretch your spine, and then exhale, fold over your right leg. Inhale. Exhale. feet down, lift your butt up, and come back to downward facing dog. Step your right leg forward, spin your left heel down, inhale, your Madrasana one. Exhale, lean forward, your Madrasana three, inhale, and exhale. Bring your right hand down, left arm up, Ardha Chandrasana, inhale, and exhale. Arjvakanasana, inhale, and exhale. Trikonasana, inhale, and exhale. Vashistasana to the left, inhale, and exhale. Three Vashistasana curls, lift your hips, inhale, exhale, curl, inhale, up, exhale, curl. Exhale, curl. Inhale, up. Exhale, down, dog. Step your left leg forward, right heel down. Inhale, warrior one. And exhale. Warrior three. Inhale. And exhale. Ardha Chandrasana. Inhale. And exhale. Bend your left knee. Parjvakanasana. Inhale. And exhale. Trikonasana. Inhale. And exhale. Vashisasana to the right. Inhale. And exhale. Curl. Lift your hips. Inhale. Curl. Exhale. Inhale up. Exhale, curl. Inhale up. Exhale, curl. Inhale up, downward facing dog, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Bring your knees down to the ground, place your feet flat, sit on the heels, sit up, inhale. Place your hands beside your hips, outside your thighs, exhale. Lean back, lift your knees up, inhale. Lean forward, lift your butt up, exhale. Now take your weight into your fingertips, lean forward more, and bring your feet up, inhale. And rock, three times. And then bring your knees down, feet down, down, sit up. Swing your legs around, stretch your legs out. One more little bit of fun core. Cosmic time. Lean back, bring your shins parallel to the ground. Lean onto your right hip, move your arms to the left, and like some really weird bicycle, pedal your arms and legs. Draw your belly in, stretch your spine. Cosmic abs. Lower part way. Lower part way. Switch sides. Come up part way. Come up part way. Switch sides. Switch sides. Switch sides. Switch sides. Lower halfway. Switch sides. I wish you could see Spooky, the cat sitting in front of me, who just yawned while I'm doing this. Oh, Cosmic Abs, so boring. Switch sides, says the cat, who does very little exercise. Switch sides. Sit up, cross your ankles. Steady your breath. Come back to your center. Downward facing.
kissing dog, jump back, float back, crawl back. Shift forward to plank on the cusp, and lower all the way down to your belly. Place your feet flat, bend your knees, grab the tops of your feet. Move your shoulders away from the ground. Engage your feet. Take your knees up. Take your feet back. Donnie Ross. Push your pelvis down. Lift through your spine. Lift through your knees. Breathe. And Spooky's like, oh, you're stretching? I want to stretch. Hey, Spooky. Do you want to get on my feet and do some acro? No. Still inside, turn it back to center. Bend your knees, grab the tops of your feet. Lift your shoulders away from the ground, away from your ears. Pick your feet up, kick them back, lift your chest up. Dhanurasana. <laughs> Spooky is being silly. You can't see, but trust me. Keep your chest lifted this time. Bring your hands like up dog, bring your feet to the ground. Lift your head, lift your chest, lift your legs like up dog. Do up dog. What's up dog? It's this. Yeah, dad jokes. Tuck your toes, push up and back. Adho Mukha Shonasana. Lift your pelvis, stretch your arms. This time when you bring your knees down to the ground, take your knees wide. Come into a wide knee, balasana, child's pose. Place your feet flat, sit on your heels, fold forward. You can do what you like with your arms, stretch them out, make a pillow for your forehead, stretch them back, lift your feet, whatever your child's pose is. Place your hands on your knees, everybody. Bring your forehead back towards your knees and bring it down to the ground. Push down with your hands slightly, just enough to actively round your back. Draw your belly in, round through your lower back, your mid back, your upper back. Maybe even come to the top of your head. You're rounding so much. And unroll your spine and sit up. Swing your legs around in front of you. Bend your right leg. Place your feet on the foot on the ground. Hug your right leg into your chest and sit up tall. Move your right knee over to the left. Hook your left arm outside your right leg. Touch your right fingertips to the ground. Look forward again. Stretch up through your spine, and then twist. Push your right hip towards your right foot. Stretch up tall through your spine. Stretch both arms up. Stretch your right leg up, bring your left leg in, hold your left leg, draw it in, give yourself a little hug and stretch your spine. Then with your right hand, move your left knee over to the right, touch your left fingertips back behind you, hook your right arm outside your left leg, look forward. Sit up tall and twist. Mary Chasna C variation. Move your feet, no, your butt towards your 
feet, lie down. Keep your knees bent, feet on the ground. Bring your feet as wide as your mat. Bring your knees together to touch in the middle. You can keep your arms at your sides. And what feels comfortable to you, place your right hand on your belly, left hand over your chest. Think about your sit bones, those bony bits at the bottom of your pelvis moving towards each other a little, with your pubic bone and tailbone towards each other a little. Engage your little bone by here. If your right hand is over your belly, tone underneath your right hand slightly. Move that back toward your spine slightly. Tone your throat. If you've lost your ujjayi, come back to ujjayi pranayama.
stretch through your arms and your legs. Bend your knees. And gently roll to your right side. talking about the importance of living, the importance of experiencing, the importance of adventure. Wherever you spend your days, your weeks, your months, look around you. Get outside. to events, plays, movies, gatherings in parks. Do whatever it is that helps you remember to live. Not just go to work, eat, go to bed, get up, work, eat, go to bed. It's important that we take the opportunities to stretch out, stretch our minds, stretch our experiences. Because this is life. This is it. Make 2018 a year of living. Thanks for practicing with me. Next week we'll be in a beach community, I think. So if the weather is Thanks for being here. Happy New Year. Namaste. Thanks, everybody. Jane's been hiding around the corner practicing as well, which is quite nice for me to have some students in, the, in class with me. Now I can see a little bit who's been tuning in. Take off the wide angle. Look, Ursko's here. Flora's been here. That's really cool. Thank you all so much for tuning in today. Some of you, you've gone past. Oh, look, there are a whole bunch of you. Martina, Eleonora, Emily, Sandy, Windra, Sarah, Karina. Hey, hello, Karina. Anna Ska is a really nice group we've had tuning in. This is awesome. Thank you so much, everybody. I am moving out into the sunlight so I can turn the camera around and show you the view from our balcony here in Casablanca. In our little busy intersection that we're at, you can see people drive like however they want. They kind of just turn corners when they feel like it and it leads to a little bit of chaos. And they've been doing all this construction across the way here. They've been working all holiday because it's not holiday time in Morocco. It's just end of the year, beginning of the new year time. We do have these palm trees all along our street. They're pretty much everywhere in town. So we're leaving Casablanca in a few days and heading to some beach community along the coast, which should be nice, although it is the Atlantic Ocean, and the Atlantic Ocean is pretty chaotic ocean, so it'll be pretty busy. Um, but yeah, that's a little tour around our spot here. Thank you so much for being here. Some of you, I'll see in the next few weeks in Ireland or Hamburg, and some of you I won't see for a while. So tune in next Wednesday for some more yoga, so at least we can sort of see each other there. Happy New Year, namaste.